I'm Ratna Bhushan. Welcome to ASGIS, Believe in Quality, Commitment and Success. So today I'm going to share you a beautiful article. Delhi Colombo ties are on the right path. Delhi Colombo ties on the right path. But Sri Lanka must now, must now commit to meeting the demands of its uh, Tamil minority. Delhi Colombo ties are on the right path. Sri Lankan Ram Prime Minister Mahinda Rajpakshe sent out a message by choosing India as the destination for his first trip abroad after resuming office and also struck the right notes in New Delhi by saying the changes made by the Indian government in Jammu and Kashmir. Last year were the country's internal affair. Mr. Rajpakshe also disclosed, discussed cooperation in counter-terrorism with his Indian counterpart, Mr. Narendra Modi, and ways to take forward the use of two lines of credit totaling $450 million, $450 million, $450 million offered by Indian last year. However, Mr. Rajpaksa sought to strike a balance between Sri Lanka's ties with India and those with other regional players such as China and Pakistan, describing India as a relation and other as a friends. India as a relation and others are friends. He also noted Pakistan help in the war with the Tamil Tiger rebels and China's help in rebuilding Sri Lanka after the war, which ended when Sri Lankan army launched a massive offensive under Rajpaksa's leadership. Mr. Modi used Rajpaksa's visit to raise India's concern about the incomplete process of reconciliations and the in the evolutions of powers to Sri Lanka's Tamil minority, saying the government in Colombo must rise to the occasion to meet the Tamil people's expectations of equality, justice, peace and respect by implementing the 13th Amendment to the Constitution, which envisages giving more powers to Tamil inhabited areas of island nation. Mr. Rajpakse and his brother, President Gotabaya Rajpakse, Mr. President Gotabaya Rajpakse, President Gotabaya Rajpakse, President Gotabaya Rajpakse, however, have said away from committing to uh, full implementation of the 13th Amendment. The Sri Lankan President have been said there could, couldn't be full devolution of powers against the wishes of the Sinhala majority and Rajpakse while speaking to a section of 13 Indian media to rule out any revolution, resolution in Tamil inhabited area that isn't accepted to Sri Lanka majority community, clearly both sides will have to do some maneuvering, maneuvering to ensure they reach common ground on this touchy issue. So Delhi Colombo ties are on the right path, but Sri Lanka must now now we commit to meeting the demands of his Tamil minority. So thank you very much to watch my program. Please do not forget to share, subscribe and like. Thank you.